things are already looking good here on your Saturday as temperatures feeling very refreshing after some muggy conditions earlier in the week. Right now, Lexington is checking in at 50 degrees. Our skies cleared, so some patchy valley fog is out there. Otherwise, today we're going to keep it pretty tranquil as eventually we'll begin to see more active conditions rolling in tomorrow. So again, after starting off with some mild temperatures this morning, we'll stay relatively mild into the afternoon as temperatures will climb into the lower 70s as we continue to see the springtime air continuing to flow into the bluegrass. Now on the Max Track Live Doppler, it looks like I was telling you a little bit of a story as we are seeing some bright returns in a circle around Lexington. That's showing you just some false echoes, some ground clutter, in fact, dealing with a little bit of a temperature inversion, meaning the temperatures are actually rising as we're climbing through the atmosphere. So no precipitation falling across the bluegrass, but where a little bit of light rain continues to fall is from Monticello continuing to arc up towards McGoffin County. So some scattered showers continue to move in from the southwest. This is all ahead of our next system is be playing a big role in your Sunday forecast. But right now we're in between systems. Of course, we have the blizzard that went through the plains and eventually brought us some showers yesterday. Now a more potent system is starting to gather across the state of Texas. Already a severe thunderstorm watch and a tornado watch are out across western Texas. This storm is going to be moving through the deep south into the lower Mississippi River, River Valley today, but eventually taking aim at the Ohio Valley tomorrow. So the severe threat stays mostly across eastern Texas into the northern Louisiana, even over towards Jackson, Mississippi. But then tomorrow, remove that severe threat from the Florida Panhandle all the way up to upstate New York. And really things are centered on the Ohio Valley, including here in the bluegrass as right now the Storm Prediction Center has the entire LEX 18 viewing area and the enhanced risk for severe weather as there is the potential for some strong, even possibly severe thunderstorms that are going to be coming in waves throughout the day tomorrow. But at least right now we're in the clear skies, though, will be partly to mostly cloudy, more clouds to the south, a little bit more sunshine closer to the Ohio River. Then as we march through the overnight hours, the war front is going to be lifting northward. So that's going to be bringing a surge of some warmer air, but also some juicier air too. So eventually as that low moves into western Kentucky by tomorrow morning, this is round number one that we're going to be dealing with. So showers begin to arrive during the pre dawn hours. There could be some stronger storms that mixed in with this initial round. Then we'll get a little bit of a break into the afternoon, but we're not done just yet Sunday as we will be seeing the potential for more strong to severe thunderstorms developing into the afternoon after the atmosphere gets some time to recharge. And in terms of storm threats, everything is on the table tomorrow, but the primary concerns will be for some damaging winds, even some hail, heavy rain too, as we could be seeing one to one and a half inches of rain before things are all said and done, looking ahead to late Sunday night. And also somewhere across the Ohio Valley, there could be a tornado or brief spin up or two. So certainly we're going to be keeping our eyes on the Max Track Live Doppler as we continue throughout the day tomorrow. But here on your Saturday, it's the outside day as we will be seeing a mild afternoon with a high of 70. More clouds and sunshine area wide, and there could be a stray shower down south. Then tonight, we'll hold off the showers and storms until closer to tomorrow morning, but that's just round number one for your Sundays. We will be seeing a more active afternoon as well, with the potential for more strong to severe thunderstorms. We get everything out of here in time for the start of the new work week. Monday is going to be cooler. We start off in the low 40s, only seeing highs in the mid to upper 50s. We'll keep sunshine around into Tuesday as temperatures quickly warm back up. Another round of rain and Storms will be around starting Wednesday night, carrying us through Friday, and it does look like things will be cooling off leading up to Easter next weekend. We'll have more LEX 18 news of Sunrise Weekends after this.